non-credit bearing courses historically and contemporarily have become spaces that attract disproportionately large numbers of African American and Latino learners. And this question of what identity students are forming becomes even more important because we need to be able to question and better understand the intersection of race with regard to math learning experience. And that's where the idea of stereotypes and stereotype threat comes. Um, are there certain stock stories around African American learners' experiences in math classrooms? From the literature we know that um, there is a profound and deficit-oriented stock narrative around those students' experiences, suggesting that, um, simply put, black students are underperforming. Uh, in mathematics at all at, at many levels, but especially um, at the transition to college and in introductory inter, introductory college courses. Um, so in in the face of that master narrative, a second question would would possibly be to what extent do those narratives find their way into students' personal stories about their math learning experience? And those personal stories um, are referred to as math identities. Um, you know, in what way do we label ourselves as math learners? How do we endorse that kind of label with certain kinds of actions? And then how do we append certain meanings to those identities for ourselves? Mm -hmm.